and uh, the last speaker for our first half will be Francis. And Francis J. Morris, he's uh, president of the Toastmaster Club in Taiwan. He's an expert communicator, a uh, digital sensei. And he excels at cross-cultural team building and training. So that's welcome, Francis, for tonight's talk. We're good? I'm Francis J. Morris, and I'm here to talk about an intonations world. So what is an intonations world? Let me ask you a question first. Do you have any friends? Yes. Show of hands, how many of you have at least one friend? <laughs> one friend. Oh, pretty good, pretty good. You're all friends. Excellent. Good, good, good. All right, put down your hands and I'm ask you another question. When you go to a new country, somewhere you have never been, how many of you, show of hands, ask a friend there? Show of hands. You have a friend, a place you've never been to? Show of hands. Okay, not so many. A reminder though. I am not talking about Facebook friends. <laughs> I'm not talking about fake people or someone you've never met, okay? I don't know about you, but I, I get tired of these digital friends that are poking me and twittering, twinkling and blinking and liking me, all right? I just tied my shoelaces. I just saw a cow. I just checked into McDonald's. I don't care. You don't have to tell me everything you're doing. <laughs> Okay, how about like just saying hi to me on the street? How about just buying me lunch? How about that? How about helping me with my business or my work? So am I here to talk about friends? Yes, I am. But I'm also here to talk about business networking and how you, by reaching out internationally, can really, really help you. It can be very helpful to you. So, there is an old way of making friends and there's a new way of making friends. The old way is like this. Here we are, we meet each other, we say hi, we make friends. Good. But the new way is we get to know people before we even meet them. That is because we live in a global world now. And this world is very fast, and we need to make friends very fast. And by making friends and getting to know people before we visit their country, this is much, much more helpful to us. So. I'm going to share a story. I went to Hong Kong, and before I went to Hong Kong, I had already been invited to a big party with 400 business people, and I had already made three new friends that are experienced and they work and live in Hong Kong. And once I got to Hong Kong, I didn't have to pay the entrance fee, which was 500 NT to this party. I saved $20, and I got 50% discount on all the drinks. How is this possible? Why did I get that? Well, I'm very cute. <laughs> oh, come on. On a scale of 1 to 10, how cute am I? Four. This is me when I was small. I was just smaller. More white. <laughs> All right, let's get back to the story. So, how did I get these discounts? It's because I belong to Internations. Internations is a community of expats that help each other. Internations is a group of people that you pay for this network, and you pay about $60 a year, about 5 bucks a month. It's not a lot and then you get part of this network wherever you go in the world. So it's, it's, it's fantastic because wherever you go, you have access to these amazing people and you also get these great deals. But I'm not here to do advertising for Intonations. <laughs> Am I an expat, you say? No, actually you are. You are an expat if you travel abroad. If you work abroad, you're an expat. If you live in a country or a culture that you didn't grow up in, you are an expat. That is the definition. We live in a world where we have to connect, and we have to stay connected. And being able to reach out internationally ahead of time, before you travel, before you get a new job, you get an edge when you do that. You get an advantage. And I'm not talking about poking and, and twinkling and, and liking. I'm talking about real people, people you can meet that can really help you at work with your career or with business. So. What are we learning from this? Well, we're learning that by mingling with other like-minded expats, you will increase your social skills, you will increase your opportunities to meet uh, other global business professionals, you will increase opportunities, finding a new job, doing business, finding a wife, a husband. And when you go home today, 
thing I want you to take away from this is, in our world today, which is very small, and we're all very connected, it's an international world. And it really helps you to reach out internationally ahead of time. To so join a business network, join internationals, there are lots of benefits. If you want to know more about my experience being an expat in Asia for over 20 years, or you want to know more about internationals, or just hang out with a really cute guy, talk to me. My name is Francis Morris. Thank you. Get out there, connect, and meet some real friends. Meet some real people. Thank you.